<laughs> All right. <laughs> quick, quick release. I meant to do that. All right, good morning, y'all. Another hot, steamy day on Clarks Hill. Uh, we're up here flipping some shallow cover with shaky heads and jigs. It's me and Jimmy today. He just caught a good one. Uh, I got this little guy, but off the same stick. So maybe we finally figured a pattern out, but uh, tune in, see what happens. Damn sure, but look, he ripped your. Did he rip your claws oh, off? I don't know. I thought he did. I mean, look. Yeah, he did. <laughs> almost killed you on that one. Uh, I've almost killed you before. Uh, pretty. Fair. He hit it good, so I like I knew. I figured I had him on. <laughs> and uh, yeah, he's he's been trying to. Columbia County into doing an elite series, but he's like the elites want too much money to come. So he said it's unlikely at least at least right now because Columbia County wouldn't make any money off of it. <laughs> yeah, Columbia County makes enough money. It sounds to me like you're just making excuses. Oh, uh, I'm gonna come up with any excuse I can. <laughs> De definitely wasn't that uh, weak hook set. Get in here. Uh, he would barely be a keeper. Nice. Oh, well, we got the skunk out of the boat finally. Maybe. record for the day. Oh yeah. Catching giants. Get. That's a, I was just about to do an intro, so that's perfect. Oh. Oh, 
dude. I was watching you. <laughs> One was walking away with it. Dude, they're like so like active. Like they're like every bite that I've had, they just took they're off. They're swimming off. It's yeah. like not a necessarily a super hard bite because yeah. they're just. Line yeah. Yep. That's why I didn't feel him. There's a wee babe. Ooh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Hair came yeah, with that one. one. <laughs> yeah. I have a striper rip the rod out of my hand. I don't know if it's just us or if they're just biting a little funny. Still hoping that this when this front starts coming through it'll get better. Yeah. Watch the it not even come through and it just be sunny and 95 all day. <laughs> see if I can get your crawl. Yeah, right. see if you got crawl in his mouth. Spot? Yep. Wet. You got some weird stuff crawl on the side. Like toe sack. Oh. It's just like a big scar. Oh. Oh, it's all weird. Yeah, I can't get this. Thing on there. No crawl. <laughs> yeah. Still throwing a shaky head. First keeper spot of the day. That's not what we're after. Riding the struggle bus today.
guys having a film and out of sequence intro here um, I'm in the truck I actually just got home we had to kind of rush to get off the water I don't know you might be able to hear or see the thunder and lightning all around me here big storm front rolling through so we had to rush off the water try to get the boat back in the shop and stuff of course the boat got soaked it always works out that way but it is what it is um, kind of a tough day but um, caught some fish had a good time with Jimmy uh, we always have a good time on the boat and caught some fish mostly dragging I would say we did a lot of kind of shallow water flipping today uh, with shaky head and jigs caught a few on a drop shot and stuff um, but overall pretty tough we didn't catch much in the way of size but that's summertime on Clark's Hill sometimes so anyways um, I'm hoping I'm getting to go out tomorrow uh, I don't really know if that's gonna happen or not yet um, there's supposed to be a lot of rain and storms for the next week or two it sounds like this big tropical storm that's coming in is gonna potentially kind of sit on top of the CSRA and dump a ton of rain on us so might keep things interesting at the lake potentially with what they're predicting it could raise the lake level a ton and that is going to be unusual typically the lake is dropping pretty hard in August uh, but with the lake rising in August that could really make things interesting It's probably gonna blow out a lot of the areas. I like to fish y'all know I like to fish skinny water up in the rivers and backs of creeks and stuff So that stuff may be pretty much unfishable. It'll probably be chocolate milk and stuff floating everywhere So I don't know Clark's Hill is always a little bit of a mystery. It's never the same day to day um, But sounds like this storm front and this tropical storm may really kind of spice things up. So I don't know uh, we'll we'll try to figure them out and I'll show you guys what happens whatever happens hopefully I can figure them out but anyways uh, appreciate you guys tuning in and I'll catch you at the next one